Hi, you guys. I'm back. I unbent the um, brooch here of the cat. I, f I figured out this one. I had to fix it. It was broken in two spots. But then there's no maker mark at the clasp. But this is what it looks like. It's pretty. It still looks like a Charming Charlie's to me. And I untangled this one. I thought... This was going to be hooked onto one of these chains and just, which I think would look better than this. I don't know. What's your opinion? I think it would look better if this was hooked to the chain and it just went in, you know, up and down as you adjusted your chain. But that's that one. And now we'll start with some more jewelry. We have. Oh, this is pretty. It's missing a stone. I think it was an earring. But I love it. I like the look of it. It's got the hoop up here. It would make a nice pendant. And I can hang something else in here too. I got another of the um, cookie Lee bracelets. So I'm going to put the earring there. Bracelet there. Well, here's an earring. I think I have the match. Yeah. One needs a hoop. This looks like a Betsy Johnson type earring. <laughs> The back is painted gold. It's glass. No. Oh, it's plastic. It's plastic. I thought they were glass. They look like glass in the jar. Those are cute. We have a stretchy bracelet again. One of those stone ones. So it's kind of like a set, I think. This is the third one. No, oh, the tag is stuck stuck. But this is like a black onyx faux. Black onyx one. Goes with the bracelets. Oh, I think I see the match to this sticking in the jar. Oh, no rip. <laughs> oh, oh, it came out. It went back in. Okay, good. These are pretty. I don't usually like feather earrings. I don't know, I just don't like them, but I like these. Sorry, give me a second. Look at these. Are they not beautiful? The colors is what's beautiful. And the le the feathers that they chose to put on here. I love that. It's very pretty. These I'm not going to put in the stack. I don't want them getting ruined. Put the bunny, I mean put the kitty on top so they don't fly away. Wow, that's a big ring. Fashion ring. It's got rhinestones on the sides. Two are missing on this side, none on this side. But look at that. This is a man's ring, I think. But a woman could wear it. Women can wear almost anything, ring-wise. Uh, let's see what we got here. We have a earring stuck. Oh, that is so cool. I have this earring I got in my last jar from, from the same store. And now I have the match. Because I liked this earring. It's plastic, but I, th I thought it was cool. So now I have the match to that. This is uh, just a spring thing. I think you use these to hold your sleeves up. Because I have some that are thick, thick ones, like a bracelet. And uh, so it holds your sleeves up. I think. I'm not sure. Don't. This is a stretchy one. This is heavy. Let me see if it has a name inside. J. Crew, I found a J. Crew one, and it actually had a name inside on one of the stretchy pieces. This one doesn't have a name that I can see right now, but it's pretty. It's got little spikes on it. It's heavy. Very heavy. This one is one of those kind of bracelets. What do you call these? Cuffs? And are you supposed to show this part when you wear it? I see. No, it's gonna. doesn't fit me. Or are you supposed to turn it to the back and show this part? comment let me know because I have no idea how to wear these because I mean sometimes this part's really pretty and sometimes it's not I don't know I guess it could be up to the person maybe oh, I got a couple of these I have three counting the one I already have the metal square uh, beads which I'm gonna test keep those together oh here's a pretty rhinestone earring you know I looked up uh, how to tell 
if it's a rhinestone or a crystal and like this you wouldn't I wouldn't be able to tell but they said rhinestones usually have foil back that's a pretty earring all the stretches don't break it's stuck on something it is stuck I think I got it Yeah, I got it. Well, I got it off of that. But then I got a big tangle here. But this is a plastic gold tone stretchy bracelet. This has a maker mark on it, but it's hooked up with some stuff. I don't know if these go to this necklace or... Oh, there's an earring that fell off. Or what? There's another earring... There's another maker mark, so there must be two necklaces here. Because this one's a maker mark too, right? Yep. Okay, so this must be two necklaces, so let's try to figure this out here. This looks like it goes in here. Where's the clasp? I can open the clasp. would be nice. No clasp. Oh, the clasp is by the maker mark, Tina. Duh. And this other one. Oh, this other one, the clasp is on it. Let's get, oh, I think there's three necklaces in here. Shoot. One's got a really thin chain. This colored uh, lobster clasp, so I don't think it's real. Because I wouldn't put a cheapo lobster clasp on it if it was real, I don't think. Also has one of those pretty shells on it. That they make those shell lamps out of. Which one broke on my Avon necklace I have. I'm not going to be able to get this right now. None of it. <laughs> I'm going to at least get one. Maybe this one will come out. No, it's still stuck somewhere. In here. It's all knotted right here. There's little button-like beads on one of these necklaces. So it's catching on everything. Okay, I'll have to do it later and show you, hopefully. Okay. There are three necklaces there, so... Here's eight. It's cold. Light green stone or glass bead. But it's cold outside here. I'm in California. It's very cold and rainy today. This is a beautiful chain. It has a maker mark on it, so let's see who made it. Icing. This is an icing chain. It's very heavy. Very good quality. I don't know much about icing, but I have a couple of their pieces, and this is beautiful. This is like a tie clip, or... Wait. It's got a magnet here. Wait, it has a name, too. It says... Oh, so... Oh, wait. Soho. S-O-H-O. Or oh, wait. Or OKOS. No, it's S O H O, I think. It's, see, it closes with the magnet. I have no idea what that is. Would that be for a tie? I wouldn't think it would be strong enough, but it's beautiful. Uh, snowflake. None of the stones are missing. It's gorgeous. If anybody knows what this is supposed to be used for, Please comment. I need all the help I can get. I like these beads. They have the ones that look like little beads on top. This is an earring. Post earring. We have a very pretty gold. No maker mark. Gold hoop here. Oh, another one of those metal rings. Which I took off already. So I'll put this one on. I didn't take this ring off. I like that ring. <laughs> this is a pretty earring. I like dangly earrings. Oh, that's my dog playing with her plastic bottle. I like that one. I don't know if that could be sterling or not. 
put it in the test pile just to see, just to make sure I mean. This is a bracelet by Icing. It's got discoloration on it. Uh, this is what the piece looks like that you're supposed to buy it for, I guess. <laughs> bracelet. Oh, well, that's going to go in the bracelet, even though it's in bad shape. So that's two Icing pieces there. Uh, this is tangled on itself. Okay, it's got a express tag. I'm just guessing it's a silver chain that has this really pretty hoop on it. It's a heavy piece. I don't know which way it goes. And it probably slides on there. It's probably just loose. We have another ring here. Oh, this is a cool pattern. It's very discolored. But I think it's a pretty ring. I'll put it on this finger. It's pretty. It's got a lot of discoloration, see? But I like the texture of it. The look. I wish it wasn't uh, messed up. This is a cuff link. See, it has this part back here. Here it is. Kind of looks like a. It's got. It's a knot, but it's got designs on it. Can you see the design? I don't know how far I have to be or how close I have to be. Maybe I should tape it off so I know where my camera, my view is. Some of the rhinestones are missing on this one. This one moves. Yay! <laughs> but the rhinestones are missing. It's pretty, but I wouldn't be able to sell it. Not that I've sold anything yet because I haven't listed. I have some people that want some pieces and I'm looking for, I got, I found most of them. Because I'm so unorganized. Oh man, this got stuck on the earring. Come on, get off of the feather earring. Oh wait. It's not a stuck. My bad. It's part of a necklace. A feather necklace. There's a feather that fell off of it. They stick back in there, so I just have to glue it, but it goes in. Okay. Oh, it is an earring. Oh my. This is an earring. It's got this. Oh, it's missing a feather. But yeah, here is an earring. Oh, is this it? The feather that came off? I have another. I have the match. I was trying to pick it off. The earring. <laughs> Take the earring. The feather off of there. Because I thought it was stuck. Oh my. Hopefully the feathers are in the jar. Because this one's missing one too. Or I could just take off one feather, one feather. And make. Or two feathers each and make earrings that way. But these are pretty too. My cats would have a field day with them though. Gotta make sure the cats can't get near them. What do you guys like? I like the blue. Okay, I'll put these here. They're a little heavier than those other ones. Oh. This, there are like tons of them in there. Okay, maybe at least six. They're little photo charms or pendants. You put the photo in, but when I was looking through the jar, I kept seeing them. So I'm like, oh, there's a bunch, a bunch, a bunch, a bunch. Huh. This goes in your hair, which I don't get yet, because I haven't, can't see what it looks like. But it has a hair clip on it. Oh, I got the match to that blue hoop here. It's stuck. Match the blue hoop. So that's good. Earring. Where's the earrings at? Oh, right there. Okay. And this. This is pretty. This goes in your hair. See, it's got a hair clip on it. I think that's a hair clip. I can't open it. Maybe they put it together. Well, I'll figure it out. But that looks like a hair clip. I have no idea. But I think this would make a beautiful necklace. I could just take it off of here and turn it into a necklace. What do you guys think about this one? These are fabric flowers. That is pretty. And if it was in your hair and it hung like this, that would be gorgeous. I can't see my hair, but... It, it just looks like a hair clip, but it's not opening or shutting. I mean, opening. Huh. There is a rubber piece on here. Maybe that's protecting it. Maybe it's never been used. Could be. I'll have to research it and see if 
I can see what it is. This one is a beautiful... Oh, it's backwards. Dyed shell. Turquoise tone. Stretchy. I have a green one that's really pretty too, but this one's nice. Looks like it's in good condition. I don't know for sure. This is... I thought this was an evil eye. Evil eye. Because I saw it was hung like this. I thought it was on a chain, but no. It goes this way. <laughs> so it's not an evil eye. Could have been. Could be. If somebody bought it and wanted to turn it into an evil eye, you could just, since it's got those, you can take this chain and hang one side over there on that side. Take the tassel, hang it down here. There you go. I think it would look better that way, but I'm not the designer. There's no uh, maker mark. It's in really good condition. No wear. So put that with that. I might change it. I'm not sure. Nah. <laughs> somebody might like it the way it is. And then if I change it, they'll be like, that's not what was on the video. I'm like, oh, no, I changed it. I made it better. No, you didn't. This has an E on it. E. I don't know why. But the other side's blank, so you could wear it. It's just really discolored. I don't think I could sell that. <laughs> I'll clean it and see how it looks. <laughs> but the way it looks now, no, 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 no. Oh, this is nice. Silver chain. Wait, does it have a... Clasp? I don't see a clasp. Well, it does mean no good. I'll have to open a link and put a clasp on it. It's at least 20 inches. Because I need it to hold stuff. Not just put a chain around my neck. Okay. Oh, pretty shells in here. wonder if that's another child's bracelet. No, some, there's an earring in here for sure. Let's see. Here's a pretty earring. I like the color. There was that. I hope this isn't another stretchy for a kid. I mean, maybe I'll just take the, all those apart and make one bracelet that fits an adult. Because they're very pretty. Uh, crystals and shells and everything on there. I liked it a lot. Well, this is a bad tangle. Oh, it's got a gumball machine on it. That is so cute. <laughs> I want to see it. Give me. Untangle. Where's the clasp at? I don't see a clasp on this either. Come on, people. Shake it. Maybe it comes out. That one did. But this one is stuck on here. Oh, it's stuck stuck. So. I gotta take it off of that. Okay, this one is cute. <laughs> it's got a gumball machine on it. <laughs> oh, and another charm. Oh, there's bonus hair here. I love miniature things, so this is gonna go in my collection. At least the gumball part. It says best, so it was a best friend's necklace. <clears throat> yeah, a lot of hair. But I like the gumball machine. I'm just going to take it off the chain and use the chain for something else. Because that's going to go in my shelf where I have all my little miniatures. Okay. This one came out. This is pretty. It's missing stones, so. You can see. It's very nice. But it's missing stones, so. I don't think I have any. Oh, it's a Lucky Brand. There's the clover. A little clover charm for Lucky. But it's missing stones, like I said, so... That's not being so old. Yeah, I don't think this is a bracelet. Because it's on chain. But they're pretty shells, too, so good. This, this one necklace is just getting stuck on everything. This black necklace here. Because it's got those... You know, the beads are all separated. I mean, uh... They each have wire through them, so those things open and they get hooked on the necklaces and stuff. If I, where's the clasp for this one? Oh wow, the chain is just really discolored. I'm hoping it's silver and it's just tarnished. Because that is a lot of stuff to have to take off. Oh, it's a different chain, hopefully. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. 
I have no idea because I can't get it off of this necklace. This one necklace. I got the clasp open. Now it's stuck on itself. It's got a lot of shells, so they're not easy to get around. I think I'm getting it, though. Almost. Hopefully. Is that on the chain? No. I just have to get this part untangled and then I can uh, pull it off of there. Why is it still hooked together? I, I took the clasp off. It's very annoying. We have a very fine silver chain here. This might be sterling. Let me see. Oh, it has a tag on it. I dropped something. Let me get it before my dog sees it. Thinks it's a toy. It has a tag that might or might not say something. <laughs> it says 95. So this says it's sterling. So I will test it. That was tangled up in that really bad tangle. That's probably why they didn't keep it. This is another chain. About 18, 20 inches. It has a clasp. So I can use that one right away if I need to. Oh, this has a ring on it. And I think part of the bracelet's missing. Because it has it. Because this, I don't think that would fit your wrist. And you have a ring on it. Unless it goes on your toe. I don't know. It's got a little ring here. And this really pretty chain. With crystals, rhinestones in it. And they're all there. So I don't know what it is. But I will hopefully figure it out. This is a broken, knotted up chain. I don't think that one's even worth fixing, but I'll look at it later and see. And now I still just have this shell one that's stuck on here. <laughs> I really want to see what this shell one looks like. Oh, there's also something stuck right there. Oh, it's one of those die bracelets from the cruise ship. No charms. So they didn't go anywhere, poor people. Oh, so sad. That would be a good uh, souvenir, I would think, you know? To have all the charms of where you go. Even if you didn't wear it anymore, you could just keep it and look at it once in a while. Yeah, this is, I don't know, the links are all messed up. But here's the, I'll have to get it untangled. This is the shells. Look at how beautiful these shells are. Look at this one. That gorgeous, and they got little uh, looks like coral on here. This piece of the coral before it's cut, cut, and just beautiful shells on here. And then it's hooked to this very big necklace. Oh, wait, that's different. Very big necklace here, it won't come off. That's a pretty necklace. Oh, wait, one of the chains still falls down. Okay, so it goes like that. Minus the shells. <laughs> so I'm put that over here to untangle. It's very pretty. And then we have some black Mardi Gras beads. Which everybody gets in their jars. <laughs> More tangles. Oh, this is heavy. Oh, lots of hair. Yeah, I could see this would take everybody's hair. There's no getting away from that. There's a broken chain down there, but this is beautiful. Look at that. It's got uh, multiple chains here, different colors, gunmetal, silver, no gold, because gold wouldn't look good. And then it's got all this. This piece is hanging here. I gotta figure out where it goes and fix it, and this one's hanging. That's probably the same piece, huh? Well, I'm not gonna tug on it. And it is just, minus this stuff, beautiful and heavy, very heavy. Yeah, I like it. Ring fell off my finger. Oh, I don't know if you can see it. It's got this, too. Just on the bottom part, because it doesn't go up the chain. It's wrapped around. It's very pretty. Put it over here to be fixed. I hope I can fix that. Figure out where those chains go, or cut them off one or the other. 
What is it? Oh, this is a fake shell. Just a little plastic shell on a chain. This was already in there. Came out with the hair stuck to it, too. This hair is all the same color. It's like it all came from the same person. It's a little pyramid earring. The really big back on it. <laughs> this is pretty. This is a stretchy. I think. Yeah, I'm not stretchy. These these are plastic, but they look at how much they glitter and shine. I like this one. I hope it doesn't break when I try to tug on it in the house. Here is a little seed bead stretchy. I got some seed beads and a, some gold chain necklace tangled up here. Oh, it's all one necklace. Okay. But it's still tangled. Where's the clasp? That might help. If I can find the clasp, I can see where it starts and stuff. Okay, well. I'm sure you guys can figure out. It just probably hangs. It's got hair in it, too. Same color hair. They hang together. That is pretty. I like the pink color with the gold. Because this is about what it would look like, I think. Like that. It's very pretty. Untangle. <laughs> oh, nice. I like these. I have a, a regular, just blonde wood one. It needs a clasp. Besides that, it looks like it's in good condition. The colors are nice. Earthy tones. I like it. I like how they put, you know, they overlap each other. Oh, I gotta fix it. Put it over here. Here's an earring. This is cute. Because they have statement necklaces like this, so this would match one of those. If you had it. Got one of the feathers that came off of that pretty earring set. Put that under there. Oh, I got another one of these bracelets. Oh, it has a tag. The other one didn't have a tag. Oh, it's just a heart charm. But these are pretty. It's got a, a... I like this color. It's like a blue-green or a aqua. That is pretty. Put them together. That would make a nice set. Keep those together like that. Oh, these are one. This is one of the ones that it stretches a little bit. You just roll it on your your hand like that. I haven't gotten one of these before. I've gotten this chain, but not the bracelet. That's pretty. It's in really good condition, like brand new condition. <coughs> Sorry. Hoping I cough. It doesn't like hurt your ears because it's so loud. Oh, this is cute. I think this is a ring. Maybe. It's a crown. I think it would be a ring. What else would it be? <laughs> Do they have crown rings? I don't know. It looks kind of funny. Maybe it's not a ring. Maybe it goes the other way like this. So people can see the crown. That looks better. I'm queen. See my crown. <laughs> we are all queens, aren't we? This is a stone. Oh, or a ceramic bead. It's cold. With wood. And it does stretch. It's very tight. I'm not going to stretch it, of course. How much more do I got? This is a, another one of those gold ones. We have two. Oh, good. We have another one of these. So you can have one for each sleeve. I might keep those because I like. I hate pulling my sleeves up all the time when I'm doing dishes and stuff. Here's a match to that silver earring. The really pretty one I liked. Oh, this is a ring. I think. Yeah, it has to be a ring. I might go that way or I might go this way. I don't know. I guess it depends on the wearer. It would fit my pinky. Oops. Sort of. I don't know which way it looks better. It's cool though. It's got wear on it. Couldn't sell it. Ooh, another ring. 
Oh, it's missing a stone. The rhinestone ring. I think it's pretty though. It's, it's adjustable. This kind of adjustable. It's not stretchy, which I wish it was a stretchy. Here's another one of those charms with the picture. Missing the plastic, but it might be in the jar here. Oh, here's a one of these must have broke. No, this is bigger. Okay, never mind. <laughs> but good, I like these. I can craft with that. Hopefully there are more. Because I like to craft. Well, when I stop procrastinating, this is beautiful. I'm guessing it's a necklace that's missing the chain. But I love, I like how it has this and that. I like, I just like it. What do you guys think? Do you guys like it or you don't like it? It kind of looks old to me. Like old 1920 style. And it's got all the rhinestones. Uh, I'm going to put a chain on that for sure. This is a little... It has a, <clears throat> a clasp on it, so I'm guessing it could be an anklet. Because it has a barrel clasp. And it, it's kind of would go on. Oh, maybe it's a bracelet. <laughs> it's pretty, though. They made little flowers. I like when they do bead work. It's not easy. It looks, it, it looks easy, but it's not. Okay, this is broken. There's another piece here. So I'll have to put this back together. So, and it has a tassel, so I'm guessing that's the bottom. I think that's a tassel. No, they all have double chains, so no, it's not a tassel. I just have to put this one together. It is um, very heavy, so it's really good quality. The other one I had was like a tin, so it was bendable. This one's not bendable. I think that's all of it, but there might be more pieces in there. It's a pretty necklace. I'm going to take a peek and see what the clock says. I don't want to take it too far. Oh, I'm, I'm at 32. So I'm going to stop here and then I'll finish this next time. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.